So you might be in a situation where you're having tracking issues on your MetaQuest 3. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons. The very first thing you're going to want to check out though, is to make sure that nothing is kind of covering up the cameras around your specific device. If you're having your headset, all you want to do is make sure that within your device itself, the headset that you have, you want to make sure nothing's covering up the cameras, that everything is good there. Because if you are covering up the cameras and if you're having issues with that, that is probably going to be the number one issue that you're going to run into. So make sure that's not the case. And that in and of itself can probably fix a lot of problems that you may end up having with your device. Now, if you do that and that's still not working, another thing that you know Meta actually kind of recommends to do is to kind of clear out your area in which you're actually tracking. So go ahead and clear out any devices or clear out anything that may be on the floor and kind of figure that out. If you're outside of the bounding box, that can also cause some issues. So make sure you know, you're know you not going through those specific problems there either. Now, on top of that, another thing you may want to do is to go ahead and see if you can actually update your headset. So if tracking is not working and if there's a lots of issues within the tracking you know segment, what you can try doing is you can just go through and just to see if you can actually you know update your software for a lot of problems that i normally typically have with my devices if i literally just go through and if i just you know update the software that can potentially end up fixing the problem so i would probably recommend doing that for you too update the hardware and that could potentially end up fixing the problem once again if that's still not working the other thing you may want to try doing is to go through and restart your headset so just go through and restart that headset of that device and a lot of times that can probably end up fixing the problem too. Again, not a guarantee, but I've personally been in this type of situation before. And what you're going to want to do is just go through and just, you know, update that device and restart it. And that could potentially end up fixing this problem as well. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. The like button helped me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.